guys and welcome to another video so today we are here in animal crossing new horizons and you can see i have a steve um design right here and then um when we go inside we'll see some more of the designs i have here so um yeah so we have like the pennsylvania and north carolina um state flag and then we have some memes here and the beautiful vector image here so basically what this is um is it's a feature you can do online through a website that i'll show you in a second where you can upload pictures and convert them into animal crossing designs so i'm going to take you through that process and show you how to put your um wanted image or your preferred image in animal crossing new horizons and you can do like memes and other things like that so let's go ahead and get started okay so now we're on google images preferably on a pc and so we're gonna get a peter bones image so you can search for an image or just get a um image that's like already in your files so what you have to do is go onto this website called acpatterns.com um slash editor or if you're just doing um acpatterns.com select editor in the menu i'll have this link in the description so you can go there so here it is um we'll use this to convert the image into an animal crossing design so press convert then take your desired image and put it on there so we could um we have to do it as a square kind of like the format for the Animal Crossing um, New Horizons design thing here. I believe this was originally meant for New Leaf, but it also works in New Horizons with all with the app and everything. So um, get the image and then you can put it in here. It's going to be um, lower quality since there's only like a, a few pixels on there. So maybe like crop it and then get the quality that you want on here. Sometimes the lower quality looks better um, depending on what image you have. So change it around until you get the one you want. Actually, I might just do a simple Peter Bones design here. So yeah, let's do high quality and then convert that. So this um, goes onto the grid for the designs for Animal Crossing New Horizons. And you can also change this stuff too. I won't be doing that this time. So generate QR code, and you can save this image if you want to. You don't have to, but um, I'll just save it on here so I can post it on Discord later. And, okay, so the next step is to go on to the Nintendo Switch Online app with the Nook link. Okay, so here we are on the Nintendo Switch Online app. Select Animal Crossing, and then go on to the Nook link here and choose designs and then scan qr code and then you just scan it on your computer and then it shows the image on here so now we're gonna go back into animal crossing after you press save there so let's go ahead and go back into the game okay so now we're back in the game so what you have to do is go on to your nook phone and choose custom designs and then um you can download a design but make sure you have the app open on your phone. So overwrite it. And here we have the Peter Bones custom design. And you can do this with any image. So let's go ahead and display it. And if you want it um, hanging on the wall in your house, do canvas. There we go. We have a Peter Bones painting. A nice Peter Bones design here. So you could basically do this with every image. It works better with um, images like these, like Steve and like pixel art and stuff like that because you're on a smaller grid. But it does help a little bit when it uh, kind of curves the pixels a little bit. Like the Peter Bones looks a lot more like the um, higher quality image when it does the curving and everything like that. And it genuinely 
genuinely looks pretty interesting when you do like um, certain images, especially these flags that I have here. I also I have the North Carolina and Pennsylvania flag there, and then I also have a couple memes here. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope that was helpful. You can try this. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and goodbye.